Buta? Uh, Stalama, Stalama. Ooh. Buta! Off and on. Uh, Stalama, Stalama. Off and on. Off and on.
Hey, do you think we could share that dragon eye? Shweki, Alpha Mata. My thoughts exactly. I'm done. I am done. This is not for me. Going somewhere? Yes, I'm going home. Where I belong. I was promised wonder and adventure and fantastical floating islands. And what I got was a Daventry that will never live up to what it once was. Daventry needs you, Graham. I know it's not what you expected, but give it time. We can work through the kinks together. It can be great once again with the right people in charge. I'm not that person. And you should stop believing in me. I could get you killed. Fine. Leave. Be a dentist for all I care. I guess the Chaka was wrong. Wh what? Eh, nothing. It was nice meeting you, Graham. Spill it. Well, a Chaka and I were chatting during your chivalry test, and he had some thoughts about you. Didn't you find it odd that Achaka entered this tournament, Graham? Did he ever tell you why? Well, he might have, but I only learned two words of his language. A horrendous famine struck Achaka's village, Ichtuwe. He left his suffering family to enter this tournament. He hoped to seek an audience with the king to plead for help. It was a long shot, even for him. Oh, great. So because of me, a whole village will starve. That makes me feel better. No. Because of you, a village will be saved. Achaka was impressed by you. He told me he was watching you on your travels to Daventry, and that you seemed like the type of person that could inspire change. More so than those bucket heads, anyways. I... I... Uh... If you're not going to compete for yourself or me, do it for the Ichtuans. They need you. You're their last hope. For those brave souls that are still with us, welcome back. Now, you may have heard some squawking from a few naysayers in our kingdom concerned with the ethics of the tournament. <laughs> but proclamations and addendums aside, this is the way we have always done it in Daventry. And this is the way we will continue to do it. Now, Knight Hopefuls, if you would be so kind as to present your eyes. Oh, hold still.
I'd look happier if that was my eye. I'd look less happy if that was my face. Look who's talking. Yes, look who is talking. Congratulations, everybody. We officially accept all the eyes presented. I'll see you in the duels. Take that and that! Oh, Mr. Springbottom. What? You're surprised I'm competing in the stuffed animal tournament? You know what? I will make some stories of my own. <laughs> I'll pick up where my last book left off. It was called 31 Ways to Slay a Monster. Get Mr. Springbottom. Hi, ya! <gasps> Gwendolyn! I'm sorry, Grandma. Oh, I'll take care of it, dear. I came to tell you your grandfather is ready for you. Run along, go have some adventures. Just try to have your next adventure away from my glass vases, please. Now it's time for my favorite part of the tournament. The duels! Ha <laughs> ha! You will compete against each other in a duel of strength and a duel of speed, with the winners facing off in a championship duel of wits. The pairings of knights were selected at random, so no complaining. I'm looking at you, Whisper. Any ties will be settled in sudden death. The winner, of course, will gain the knight position. The duel of strength will take place at our fantastical and wondrous floating island. And bring your steed to the tournament theatre for the duel of speed. Please unveil the tournament board. I will remain here for any questions. Good luck! <laughs>